am back, and uh, that was game one for Shunyu. Need to get in the Alsa uh, to ring you, and you're in. So that was game one for Shunyu, and I am so sorry, guys, that I had to leave you here with Laughing Man so he could dribble on about his life story oh. and. You know, I, his I really it, bad British it, impersonations. I called it and it happened. What can I say? His really really, passing or brilliant really bad passing. British impersonations. And I'm so sorry that I had to leave you with that. I promise I will not British do it again. Alright oh, then, Jade, you can take away the introductions then on MLG Metalopolis. Way to like cut out half of my introduction, you know. I was totally gonna be like, so we are on MLG Metalopolis and spawning on the uh, right hand side, the lower right hand side of this map, we have Blinky, our green Protoss, and opposite him on the uh, left hand side, the upper left hand side, we have our champion from the last match, Sean Yu who did a really annoying build with Siege Tanks, Banshees, and Marines, and oh my god, Terrana Imba. That's... Put the one with one, by the way. Yeah, no shit. Excuse me, we have a lot of time to kill before anything exciting happens in this game, okay? Alright? Look, they are only just building pylons and... Can, can okay, I can drop some analysis on you if that's alright? Really? Really? You've just I bored mean, the shit out of all our viewers for so long, and you want to, like, bore them again? Well, not really. Um, so just kind of put the one-on-one. There's a, the variety of builds. One is to go Stargate. You get Phoenix out, and you can counter the Banshees pretty hardcore. And you can keep them in their base very quick, and you actually pick up the Siege Tanks during the engagement. But that takes Gosu Micro. Do not do that at low levels, because you don't really... It's kind of... It's very uh, micro-intensive. Uh, what I'm going to suggest, one gate expo into Fast Expand. You need to um, get about two to three Immortals out. And you just get a shit ton of units out. Just a dickwood of, um, you need to have about six, seven stalkers, a bunch of zealots, and about three immortals, and two base. And you need to try and hold it off, because that's, usually they're being half their SCVs, and that's what you need to watch out for. So, yeah. But yeah, I really, I kind of really liked his one one It was actually pretty effective. Uh, Blinky, I'm not sure if he's ever played against that before. Is it what before? But I just hope he... Oh, is he going to get yes, this? Yes, Blinky! Yes! Oh, Blinky! Yes! Yes! Oh, yes! Oh, I, Blinky, Bill, you are a champion. Go back. Go back and harass. This That's a Lilacan probe right there. Now, Lilacan <laughs> got two the other day. That was baller. Oh, my God. Yes! Blinky, multitasking like a boss. He's moving that probe, and he got back to his own ass. Well, obviously, he is just a Korean. So we do have the orbital coming out for Shonyu, and, uh, yes! <sighs> yes. Well done. Well done, Blinky. I, I approve of this. I really do. I personally think he, uh, uh, wow. He's going for the 1-1 one -one again. Really? So yeah, first you don't exceed, do the fucking same build and win. <laughs> <laughs> oh, and what? Why did he put a pile on there? You do realize Terran can float buildings, right, man? This isn't Zerg. You just wasted 100 minerals. Doing nothing. You just wasted ammo. Oh. I don't understand his thought process there. Well, Blinky, he needs to one get expo right now. It still delayed him. A bit, so. Uh, nothing's delayed at all. Actually. No, but if he was going to... Oh, no, no, he, he's not, like, that's why you got a really quick factory. Yeah, I know he's right not, I know he's not, but does Blinky know that? Like, does Blinky have an observer in his base, like, right now? No, he doesn't. So, you know, he, the Terran very well could have been expanding, you know, so... It's kind of I one mean, of those what-if situations. Out, that's the annoying thing about Terran, you have to scout ridiculously well, otherwise they're just, like... They can hide everything behind their wall, like what a normal Terran would do. They hide their barracks and everything behind this uh, wall, and they have a bunker there. And they just sit there, and you're like, well, shit, I can't get in unless I have a robo. You know, so you kind of force down the robo tech, tech path. You have to say if you go Banshees, and you're like, I hope this works, and like, you do it, and oh, it just doesn't pay off. You just kind of feel shitty, and yeah, like, see, he's just going three gate. Like, dude, like, you got rolled the last game. Why would you do the same thing? Like, uh, I don't know. He's just going to die again. This is going to be really, really kind of bad. See, when he saves a 200, he's going to drop a Raven. And then, see, Raven, and we're going to see a 1-1-1 again. 
Point defense drone is really good. Yes, hopefully he doesn't supply buck himself every one minute this time again. Uh, he needs to get siege mode now, I think, or... Actually, no, I think he get that a bit later. I'm, I'm not quite sure. Well, he is supply blocked. Exactly, again. He always supplies blocks himself. We do have the robo right. again. The robo again for Blinky. No, robo's a, robo's a very good choice. He just needs to one-gate expo until, like, three, four gates, and then pray to God. I mean, I love that he's going Raven first. That means, like, any uh, harassment by, like, DTs is kind of nullified if you try to. So, 1-1-1, one, one, one. good build order. She's going to win. Oh, we've got Robo. Siege Tanks out, so, um, yeah. Well, yep, yeah, it's pretty much going to be a complete build order loss for uh, Blinky here. I'm really disappointed because he's actually a really nice guy. I mean, I just kind of gather, gathered that anyway, but... <laughs> yeah, oh, you kind of can't, I mean... This is the this is the annoying thing about Terran. You have to respond respond perfectly to the what type of one 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 they're doing because there's different types of one one ones. It's ridiculous. You could go the cloak banshee variant. You could be going the uh, like you know you could go start and go yeah I got phoenix out. Bam, you're dead. Bam, they're cloaked. Fuck, I don't have detection, and then you're dead. Like it's so hard to understand and so annoying to just read it because they can go cloaked. They can go something else. They can you know. Because then they won't have as many siege tanks if they have cloak, you know. Oh, sorry about that. Oh, I feel a bit tired. I haven't actually been to sleep yet today, so I'm feeling a bit there. Even though I've had two Red Bulls, I need a man up. <sighs> well, Blinky did have an observer in there for a little bit, so he knows that there's shit coming for him soon. I don't understand, he's warping in Zolts, he needs to warp in Stalkers, or, you know, he just needs to chrono out two, three Immortals. He's getting a uh, charge. Oh, that's a brilliant idea, but it's not going to finish in time. The push comes out around ten minutes, and bam, here we, here he comes to wreck the day, and it's going to be game. Like, just, you know, this 1-1-1 one, one, one isn't even, like, refined at all. I mean, I, I mean, it is kind of refined, but, like, Usually being half your SCV, so like, imagine that with all that tanky damage of SCVs going, ho oh, oh, and they just repair everything. They repair the Ravens, they repair the Banshees, like, and he's only got one Banshee. Usually you have two or three, and you just kind of fucking kill everything. Like, this build is so good. Like, how long until production is done? Uh, oh my, it's done. Oh my god, he actually might be able to hold this. Oh my god, he just needs to warp in Zealots. He actually, I didn't realize Zealots' legs was that nearly done. Wow. He needs to get the better. He needs to go down the ramp. If he gets funneled on the ramp, he's just going to die. No, Move no, no. Move down, Blinky. Move down. Yay. Oh. Oh. He is going to be in a world of pain. I feel so sorry for him. Come he's on, just Blinky. Get Watch this. He's just going to get funneled. Yep. Ready, Game ready, up. ready. Oh, oh no. My. Those zealots took so much damage. Oh. Oh, here it comes. Uh, oh, we're back. Mm. Why would you force filled it out? What are you doing? Oh, my God. Really? <laughs> wow. I don't understand. That was a very, Just very terrible force field. Um, do not agree with it at all. Right. Okay, guys. I'm just going to warp in and, like, prevent myself from attacking. She'll be right. And yeah, this is this is game. Like, Blinky really needed to move down. Like, you cannot just stay up top and when you've got like a ramp like this. Yeah, so you need to be. You need to buy as much time as possible in the one-on-one, -on -one, guys. You need to. You need to battle in the middle. You need to kind of like make them push you, not in your base. If when they get to your base, it's game over because they can just siege you from billion years away. So. And here it is, Blinky. I salute you, GG. my good man. Well, well played, guys, and you know these are fairly decent low-level players, considering they both got into the you know semi-finals and that. Like it was well played by both of them. We saw Blinky win a few games, and now we will be watching Sean Yu in the finals. Decent games, yeah, one on one.
I, I kind of cry every time I see it just because you're like, it's just, it's so annoying because you have to do a certain way. And by the way, guys, just thought we'd point out, we've got more viewers than the Daywalker Platinum and Under. Holy shit. Guys, big hearts to all you all. I can't believe they're actually more popular at the moment than the Daywalker. That's, that's pretty good. <laughs> that means our casting is lovely. That's all thanks to you guys. Thank you. Oh, Big hearts out of the chat.